Alright, this video is going to be about how to foil homemade lures. So, the first thing that you need to do is to trace out the outlines, which I'm going to glue on later. Uh, it's a really good idea to use the actual lure to trace out the shape of the foil that you're going to glue on later. And um, once that's done, um, you just cut out the shape like I'm doing here. And I'm almost done. There. Um, I usually sort of uh, prep the foil by using the foil to to the lure by using a sponge. Doing this helps with uh, with the wrinkles later on, which are a real pain in the ass. <laughs> but um, there's ways to get around that. Um, When that's done, I just uh, smear paper glue to the side that I intend to foil. The idea is to have a nice thin layer of glue so that you're not gonna get huge blobs of it under under the foil. Mm. So yeah, just. Um, Make sure that it's very thin and you're not gonna get those blobs in there because it's not gonna look very pretty under under the foil later on. And um, once that's done, you just um, place the foil onto the bait and um, press it with uh, with the sponge that I was using later using before before um, okay now now that the foil is on I'm just gonna start evening out the wrinkles um, you need some sort of uh, round edged instrument um, like uh, the back end of scissors the ones that I'm using here uh, you can also use your thumb uh, to even out the wrinkles. It's actually a pretty effective uh, method to use. And you just um, go around the bait, evening out the wrinkles. Making sure that everything is nice, nice and smooth. So yeah, uh, that's the method I use for most of my foiling jobs. And uh, as always, if you have any ideas for future videos, just send me a PM or let me know in the comments section below.